When I first met Barbara, she had this 15-year-old Scottish Terrier she was trying to squeeze another year out of. And the, and, the, and, the, and the first time I saw this dog, I was like, oh, man, this dog's about to die. And I don't, I don't want to go through the death of this dog with this woman around. I just met her, and I'm not that sensitive. It's good that you know that. I, no, I do know it. And sure enough, two weeks later, clunk. <laughs> Dead, and she is inconsolable, in bed, oh, sobbing. Now, I've seen people lose it over the death of a pet, right? But right. this dog lived 15 years. Right. If you want much more than that out of a pet, you need to get a tortoise or a tree. <laughs> <laughs> Well, she's in bed sobbing, and I, this is what happened. I, I didn't know what to do, and I call Foxworthy, and I tell him, buddy, I'm lost. Yeah. And he goes, get her another dog, or however he talks. That, you know? I think it was Larry. Wasn't that, wasn't that Larry the that cable guy? Been Larry. I think you called Larry the cable That's guy. That's who it was. <laughs> I threw the speed dials right next to each yeah, other when I, got, when I contact Larry. my boys. <laughs> yeah, yeah. But, uh, and I tell her, I said, honey, I'll get you another dog. And she loses it, right? She says, I don't want another dog. I never want another dog. I want my daddy back. And I was like, wow. And I listened to it for like a week. And then I'm like, you know what? I'm going to get her another dog. And I find a place that breeds Scottish Terriers, not too far from where we live. And I get her in the car and I tell her where we're going. And at first, she's against it. I don't want another dog. I never want another dog. <laughs> But we get down there, she sees them all hopping in the window. Pick me, pick me, let's go, let's go. <laughs> and I buy her this little black Scottish Terrier puppy, and I give it to her. And folks, it heals her heart. Mm -hmm. This little puppy heals her broken heart. Oh, that's wonderful. Well, two weeks ago, her father passed away, and I'm like, I think I see a way out of this. <laughs> So I, so I get her in the car, and she doesn't know we're going to the old folks' home. Oh, I see, uh... And when I tell her at first, she's against it, right? I don't well, yeah. want a new daddy. I don't want a new daddy. Oh. But we get down there, she yeah. sees them all hopping in the window. Pick me, pick me. She wanted a black one. I'm like, keep it simple. She got a black one. He acts weird when I'm in the room, but I think it's because he smells my daddy on me. Yeah, yeah, that could be it.